WNCT is living local all month long, highlighting a different ENC community each day. And today's stop is about halfway between Greenville and Raleigh. Not on your sides, Ken Watlington is on the road today in historic downtown Wilson. How's it going, Ken? Yeah, Angie, there's so much to see and do across all of downtown Wilson. And maybe the best place to start is right here at the one of the more unique parks you will ever visit. We're inside the Wallace Simpson Whirly Gig Park along South Goldsboro Street. This park is filled with 30 giant sculptures made from recycled industrial parts. All of them were put together by the late Wallace Simpson, who lived most of his life just down the road in Lukama. He got started on these Whirly Gigs when he was 65 years old, putting them up in the field across from his workshop. He first called them windmills, but folks around Wilson County started to call them whirly gigs, and that name stuck. No matter the name, they became iconic in these parts, a definite roadside attraction if you're traveling through Wilson. The park officially opened here in, back in 2017. Unfortunately, that was four years after Simpson passed away in 2013 at the age of 94. But his work lives on today here at the park for everyone to enjoy. The park is open daily from 5 in the morning until midnight. The shelter here at the Vala Simpson Rolling Gig Park also hosts the Wilson Farmers and Artisan market every Saturday during the summer. But that's not all that's going on in this area of downtown Wilson. We'll tell you more about that coming up a little bit later in this week's People in Places. But for now, we are living local live in Wilson. Ken Watlington, 9 on your side. Awesome. Ken, thank you so much. And we're living local every weekday through the entire month. So join us tomorrow as 9 on your side's Julianne Dell heads to Moorhead City for a look at what makes that community so unique.